Alright, we're live. Alright, we're gonna play the Google Autofill game. If you don't know what that is, we type in our question, which is, when you're drunk, can you? And then each letter of the alphabet, and we're gonna answer the question. The, the first question that Google gives us. Alright, so... Uh, Before we start, we got this idea from the Super Carlin Brothers. These guys are fantastic. They're awesome. Go look them up. And, uh, I don't know if they're got the idea from somebody else, probably, but that's where we got our idea, so, all right, now we're going to start. All right, so, for A, we have, when you're drunk, can you act? What do you think, man? I'm going to go with yes, because uh, Robert Downey Jr. I like to think I can do <laughs> most things drunk. I can do most things drunk. And I feel like acting makes that list. Especially if you practice. Exactly, like, people... Don't crash their cars because they can't drive drunk, or because they're driving drunk, it's because they never learned how to drive drunk. If you have the proper training, it is possible. Also, but while, don't drive we're, drunk. while we're on this A, I would like to point out that while the first choice makes sense, the rest of these the following choices, they uh, do you not probably cannot make sense. see that. It, it doesn't We've make got sense. stuff like when you're drunk, can you a magic trick? Can you a plane? Can you a bottle of wine? Can like, you apple it cider? It turns out that people are drunk when they ask this question, and so you don't get complete sentences most of the time. All right, let's move on to B. Uh, I'm going to go with the first one that's almost a real question. It's when you're drunk, can you buy beer? And I will take this time to mention that buy is never spelt with a U, it's always B-Y. I have a story. My stepdad... <laughs> <laughs> my stepdad all of a sudden there this is going we were driving into town and he wanted to buy more beer I, and yes you heard me right more beer <laughs> yeah I think it was the next 30 racks so we stopped at the store <laughs> and before he goes in Darian do you have any gum? uh no sorry ah oh, fuck what? he reaches into the, his ashtray and he takes two cigarette butts and eats them so that when he goes into the store, his breath does not smell like alcohol. It smells like cigarettes. So I guess if you're a genius like my stepfather and real committed, yes, you can buy beer when you're drunk. Real, real committed. Holy shit. Although, apparently not when you're high, because I walked into a liquor store a few months ago, and I went up to the counter, and I was checking out. I had just handed him my money, and he's like, just so you know, you smell like pot, and I could have refused your sale just for that. And I was like, oh, well, fuck you. I'm not going to buy from here anymore, then. <laughs> also, as long as you figure out how to handle yourself after you've been drinking, you can absolutely still buy beer. You just have to make the bartender or the, the liquor store employee not realize just how fucking wasted you are. Or send a friend. Yeah, but that goes back to A for acting. Like, just rock that shit. Get your game on, bitch. Get your game on. <laughs> All right, All right. Ready to move on to C. C. When you're drunk, can you control yourself? No. <laughs> Moving on. <laughs> D. <laughs> and we will go ahead and move on. It's when you're drunk. I mean, this one's fairly obvious. When you're drunk, can you drive? The we already answer answered this. Is Always, no, don't do it. Don't fucking do it. You can't condone that shit. But practice makes perfect. Keep that in mind. When you're drunk, can you X? I mean, that's the first one. The first one that makes sense. X like EX? Yeah. Yes. The first real question is, when you're drunk, can you eat? And like, no. is there when a better drunk, time? When you're drunk, you should eat. Like, is there a better time to fucking stuff your face? A McDouble... Tastes oh. like orgasm. You ever had Taco Bell at two, in a, 2 o'clock in the morning fucking hammered? It's what God tastes like. Chalupa is like Thanksgiving dinner when you're drunk. Alright. F. F. When you're drunk, you. can you feel? I mean, I suppose that depends on what you're drinking. Uh, and also... You know, you're, you're smashing vodka or maybe tequila. You don't feel shit. <laughs> Either way, you're gonna feel horny. But you can also feel angry, <laughs> sad, feisty, no, I feel defiant, like, I feel like depressed. I feel like beer is the sad, the sad drink. I don't know. When I'm sad, I drink wine. You're also allergic to beer. You're right. <laughs> this is cider, if you couldn't tell. All right, moving on. G? When you're drunk, 
can you? All right, so all of these are get off, but not in a dirty way. I'm talking like get off wine. Once you're drunk, can you stop drinking? I uh, can't. <laughs> no. Yeah, I'm, I'm pretty mean, terrible well, at that. Did you run out of liquor? That's fair. If you're out of liquor, that's it. You're done. But if you still have liquor, the answer's no. You cannot get off whatever you're drinking. Why do we play? To get fucked up. H. All right. So this shit just doesn't make sense. I don't. There isn't. There isn't a real question in any oh, of these. I've got a fun story for this. When you're drunk, can you hand sanitizer? All right. So that's not a question, but. <laughs> They did it anyway. In middle school, I knew a girl who said that hand sanitizer smelled like vodka. And she's definitely not wrong. <laughs> so one day at lunch, we got those stupid little foil lidded cups of orange juice. And we put a bunch of hand sanitizer in it and we drank them. Because they tasted like screwdrivers. When you're drunk, can you hand sanitizer? No, but hand sanitizer can make you a little drunk. Dude, how are you not dead? We smoked caffeine. How are we not dead? How are we not dead? Alright, so the first question under H, for real, hand sanitizer is number three, by the way. There are two dumber answers than hand sanitizer. <laughs> when you're drunk, can you how do? <laughs> how, how can you how do? Can you do how you? It's an LMFAO song waiting to happen out there. <laughs> <laughs> so, yes? Yeah. Alright, moving on to I. Dude, like... None of these make sense. Apparently the drug community just, like, doesn't have their shit together. Who would have thought? I like to think that I can, uh, question better Num- than this. Number two kind of makes sense. When you're drunk, can you in public? When you're drunk, can you in public? Well, that depends. What have you been drinking? (laughs) How much have you been drinking? If you've been drinking tequila, and if you've smashed a fifth by yourself, you can absolutely not in public. Also, it depends who you're with. If you look like us, and you're walking down the street with your even drunker friend, who is a woman who is much, much too hot for you... Sometimes you might get stopped by the police, and they're going to try and ask you where you're going with her. I remember this. This is a real thing. It actually happened. It was a great night. And she was, you're right, much, much too hot for us. (coughs) (coughs) All right. Moving on. I like where these people are at. For Jay, we have, when you're drunk, can you jello shots? Yes. Absolutely. Game of Thrones parties. I have been bribed into New taking extra shifts at work with Jello shots. People be like, "Hey, will you take this shift? I'll pay you in ju- just Jello shots." And I'm like, "You know what? That sounds absolutely fucking fantastic, and it works every single time." It also, might make your shift better. That'll absolutely make your shift better. <laughs> when you're drunk, can you know what you're doing? Well, that depends. Again. What are you doing? <laughs> Again, I come back to what you've been drinking. <laughs> and uh, and that's about what you get on that one. Because you know drunk you better than we do. For L, when you're drunk, can you Listerine? <laughs> I mean, if you get stopped by the cops, you should have some with you. And that, that, the penny under the tongue trick doesn't necessarily work, but I drank most of a half gallon of vodka and then passed a breathalyzer by doing that, so... So it doesn't necessarily not work. <laughs> also, honorable mention, second answer, and this is a real question. When you're drunk, can you lose weight? I mean, when I feel I'm, like you'd be real motivated to. When I'm drunk, I like to have sex, and that burns calories, so yes. I've also seen you eat three quarters of a pizza. (laughs) Okay, I guess we're back to depends what you're drinking. (laughs) This is uh, when you're drunk, can you mouthwash? That's the same question. When you're drunk, can you... Oh, I finally got one where it changed the question a little bit. 
Sometimes it'll change the question. You just got to kind of roll with it as it happens. This one is, can you take melatonin when you're drunk? You know, if you can't sleep, maybe. But you're probably going to black out if you do that. It also might be really hard to wake up. Like, have you ever pounded an entire bottle of NyQuil and then had to wake up the next morning? It's not easy. It is, it is not a great time. <laughs> All right, moving on to N. I don't even know what this question means. When you're drunk, can you nut bush starts? <laughs> what the fuck is that? All right, I'm going to look that what what <laughs> Nut bush starts. <laughs> Is there anything else on there while I look this Hold up? Hold on. I really like the third option. It's when you're drunk, can you not? <laughs> <laughs> can you just not? <laughs> can, can you not? And I feel like there are quite a few people that I know in my actual life on a day to day basis that it's like, man, can you just fucking not? Uh, he's one of them. <laughs> I play a 60 card elemental hero deck. Maybe I should just not. For y'all that don't know, we're a couple Yu Gi Oh nerds. <laughs> you got any Yu Gi Oh love in this background? I've got a Millennium Puzzle here. There's a sexy Dark Magician girl there, or a Kalthos Nat, and naked Dark Magician girl there. That's for any Yu Gi Oh card to take. You're right. Kaibun is up there also. Also, um, on this table. This, uh, this red blur, hold on, over here, this is said 60 card elemental hero deck, right there, and over here, this uh, black mask that you can see on the table, that would be my uh, halfway decent blue eyes deck. You figured out what a nut bush start is If yet? you're wondering why I am flipping my phone over and over, it's because there's a giant melt mark in the middle of my screen. Oh right, and someone I can't, can't use the letter keys. T. Or why? Oh. And sometimes you. <laughs> what the fuck is a nut bush start? There's a dance called a nut bush. So, I mean, I like to dance when I'm drunk. Actually, that's the only time I like to dance. Yeah, it's a, it's a real, it's a dance, evidently. If you can't tell, we uh, don't give a shit about this that. This one thing says it's safe for work, so I don't know what kind of dance it is, but apparently you could do it at work if you're drunk at work, which could happen. All right, let's move on. It could happen. That'll happen. All right, so O also doesn't make any sense. Let me see if we can put it in this way. And no, still doesn't make sense. When you're drunk, can you owl? Well, that depends. Are you a wizard? Moving on. You mean who? Who? All right, now. <laughs> All right, so autocorrect changes it around a little bit. Can you get pregnant when you're drunk? Yes. That's how it happens. Always. Not that's, always. Usually. That's how this game is played. Moving on. Moving on. You. When you're drunk, can you quote? Depends. Are you good at quotes? Because uh, I can usually remember most of the quotes that I know. But yeah, if you're bad fair. at quotes, I'm my fiance. You can't. You can't remember them when you're sober, so probably not. All right. So autocorrect is changing our around on us a little bit. But again, can you remember things when you're drunk? Well, I mean, I can typically remember how I got drunk. You can usually remember major events, like if you nailed someone. But once you black out, usually that's the stopping point. And I feel like you can remember things while you're drunk. It's the next morning where you may not yeah. remember things that yeah. happened while you were drunk. Like, when I'm blackout drunk, I can still be like, Hey, motherfucker, give me my lighter back. Yeah, but, but you won't remember shit about hugging that wolf or calling that stripper a dirty name. Or nailing your shoe to a tree. <laughs> Moving on. <laughs> Moving on. <laughs> when you're drunk, can you S? So switch it around again. Can you sleep when you're drunk? Well, I can pass out pretty well typically, but then I wake up like two or three hours later needing to shit my guts out, and I puke sometimes. And then if the sun is out, I have to find my glasses because I will just die. No, I go the full like seven, eight hours. I fucking wake up when my alarm goes off, but that's rarely early. So, you know, you just kind of fucking wake up 
put on your big boy pants and deal with it. If I see the sun when I'm hungover, I will literally die. Will you not push darts? <laughs> yes, you can dance when you're drunk. <laughs> we're going to have to find this dance and do it for you, I guess. Alright, so we're going to do the first two of when you're drunk, can you, the letter T. Because both of them are so very relevant to just, like, where life is. When you're drunk, can you text? I gotta tell you, I text a lot. And the answer's no. No, you fucking can't. Me? No. Because I can't type T, U, or Y. <laughs> it doesn't matter how great my autocorrect is or how well my phone thinks that it knows me. It never knows drunk me. That's true. And then the second one. Can you tell when you're drunk? Yes. Do you know how to be honest with yourself? Are I you... Think are you lying to yourself like my mother does every time she's drinking? It's totally fair. I think we all know where that line is. And while we may get a shot or two too deep before we notice it, when you notice it, it's fucking there. Here's how to test if you're too drunk to drive. Get in your driver's seat. If you sigh, get back out. <laughs> that's that's <laughs> <real>. <laughs> That's what I did the last time I was like, alright, so, this this brings up a story. I don't like wine. He does not like wine. And this fucking guy, we smashed, like, what, three quarters of a bottle that night? And I don't uh, drink wine. Maybe more. So, like, I don't have a tolerance for wine. Like, I can drink rum literally all night. But you start throwing wine at me, and it's, like, half a glass. And I start to get a little whoopy. First time my fiancé took the baby away somewhere else for the night, and I had alone time, I drank 14 glasses of wine, and then I died for like three days. I got out into my truck, and I'm pretty sure the first thing I did was sigh. Like, I didn't even think I had the key in the ignition, I was just like... <laughs> yeah. If you ever sigh, and then say yeah, you do not have this, go back inside and call an Uber. Hey, hey, Darian. <laughs> Tell me. When you're drunk, can you ugly? <laughs> <laughs> Two words for you. Kayla Coronado. <laughs> <laughs> That's a very real thing. Um, moving on. Mary Chester. Now I'm moving on. When you're drunk, can you be? When you're drunk, can you vine? I've, I mean... I've never vined, so I cannot say. And I'm pretty sure, like, you can't anymore. I don't think it actually exists. I'm pretty sure all the vines I see are now on YouTube. When you're drunk, can you video? Uh, well, look at Hello. the title. Hello. Hi. That's us. <laughs> also, when you're drunk, can you Viagra? That's actually a good question. Well, I don't usually need... Any motivation to get it up when I'm drunk, but I suppose if you're old and you can't, that you would be a like, good time. Like, suppose you're a 60 year old man. Like, you've got Viagra, which is supposed to help, like, strengthen your blood vessels in your dick, and then you also have alcohol, which thins your blood out. So, like, does it bring it back to normal ED? Or does it give you super ED? Or does it, like, I suppose. We come back to what you're drinking. Where does, coke, where does coke dick factor into this? Whiskey dick is a real thing. Hashtag whiskey dick. <laughs> Sorry, I had to run back through my uh, alphabet real quick. W. When you're drunk, can you what happens? <laughs> <laughs> Alright, well, so I feel like this question says more about the people who ask this question. <laughs> like, I feel like there's a ridiculous reason that this is the top answer on the Auto Phone. That means that people ask this question frequently. Let's point out that number two is when you're drunk, can you what do? <laughs> Alright, now I gotta see the rest of it. When you're drunk, can you work out? Like, yeah, if you're looking to throw the fuck up. Wait for it. Push ups. Hold on. Oh. When you're drunk, yes. can you... Uh -oh. What are you doing? What are you doing? Did it get any of that? I don't know. Whatever. I don't know. Moving on. This needs charge, too. I'll go grab the charger. Uh, 
X. Um, nothing for we're X. We're going with nothing for X. We're back to can you control yourself? No. To recap, no. All right, so this second one I will be right. for for Y is when you're drunk, can you your people? Why are we not asking better questions on autocorrect? I'm fairly disappointed in all of us right now because these top answers mean that people, and keep in mind I'm spelling it with the apostrophe, your, you are, I'm spelling it the correct way. This is what the intelligent part of the community is answering these questions with. Be better, folks. And for the last one, I don't know that Zuli is a real word. When you're drunk, can you zoom? Well, what are you zooming on? If you're in a crotch rocket, yes, go kill yourself. Zoom right away. <laughs> don't drink in crotch rocket, folks. But you could. But, but don't. Don't own a bad. Don't own a crotch rocket either, though. Also, for real, get a real motorcycle. <laughs> All right. Well, I think that's the end of our game. So let's. Uh, I let's, would agree. Let's finish up our drinks real quick. Folks, you have an excellent night. Thank you for joining us. Make sure to like and subscribe, and also go check out Super Carlin Brothers because they are much more entertaining than us. Straight up.